how to fix this device cannot start. Code 10, error. Method 1. Run the hardware and devices troubleshooter. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. In the run dialog type in msdt.exe dash id device diagnostic and click OK. Click next in the hardware and devices troubleshooter window. Apply the suggested fixes. Restart your PC. Method 2. Update the device driver via the device manager. Right-click Start, and select Device Manager. Expand the device's category list of the malfunctioning device. Right-click the device marked with a yellow triangle with an exclamation mark, and click Update Driver. Select Search automatically for drivers. Windows will search your PC for the best available driver, and install it. Alternatively, select Browse My Computer for Drivers. Click Browse and select a driver you downloaded from the hardware vendor's website, or click Let Me Pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Select a driver from the list of available drivers, and click Next. Click Close. Click Yes to restart your PC. Method 3. Roll back the device driver. Right-click Start, and select Device Manager. Expand the device's category list of the malfunctioning device. Right-click the device marked with a yellow triangle with an exclamation mark, and click Properties. In the Properties window, select the Driver tab. Click Roll Back Driver. If no previous driver is available, the Roll Back Driver button will be grayed out. Method 4. Delete the upper filters and lower filters values in Windows Registry. Right-click Start, and select Device Manager. Expand the device's category list of the malfunctioning device. Right-click the device marked with a yellow triangle with an exclamation mark, and click Properties. Select the Details tab. Open the Property drop-down menu, and select Class GUID. In the Value section, take note of the GUID. You can right-click the GUID, and click Copy. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open Run. In the Run dialog, type in Reg Edit, and click OK. In the Registry Editor, navigate to H, key underscore local underscore machine backslash system backslash current control set backslash control backslash class. Expand the class key. Find the GUID that matches the GUID value you noted in Device Manager, and select it. You can add a backslash, paste the GUID value, and press Enter. Locate Upper Filters and Lower Filters GUIDs. Note that you may find either Upper Filters or Lower Filters, which is normal. In the right pane, right-click Upper Filters and click Delete. Click Yes to confirm the removal. Then, right-click Lower Filters and click Delete. Click Yes to confirm the removal. Restart your PC.
Hopefully, this video provided you with the information you were looking for. If you're using a Windows computer, we suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. Combo Cleaner's real-time anti-malware scanner will stop malware from gaining a foothold on your PC. Anti-ransomware protection will protect your most precious files against being encrypted by ransomware. Combo Cleaner's web browsing protection will block scams, malicious websites, and downloads. Also, Combo Cleaner's Duplicate File Finder and Big Files Finder will help you clean up your PC and save gigabytes of valuable disk space. Don't let malware wreak havoc on your computer. Download Combo Cleaner today. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.